Hey everyone, welcome back to my beauty room. So today I'm super excited because it's been a long time coming. I am going to be filming a huge TJ Maxx home goods haul and I'm going to do this in two parts. I like to do two parts because I like to include swatches like of every palette and stuff. And if I drag it on, I think it's going to drag on too long. Let's put it that way. If I do everything with swatches all in one video. So I'm going to do, do this. <laughs> so I'm going to do this in two separate parts. So the first part, I do have a bin. I've, I've already separated the bins. So the first part, I'm going to be showing you more like stuff I got in between like home goods and TJ Maxx. So I do have a lot of goodies in here. And then the second part, so stay tuned. I'm going to be filming all of the palettes. I got tons of palettes. So I'm going to be including swatches and everything throughout that part two haul. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing that I see here is this for $4.99. So this one I got at Home Goods. So usually the um, home kind of goody little things, it's at Home Goods. And at my location, I have the two stores, Home Goods and TJ Maxx combined. So Forgive me if I say I got it at TJ Maxx and it's really at Home Goods, but I'll try to emphasize where I got it from and then so forth like that. So this I got at Home Goods, <laughs> and look at it's so cute. It says Busy Bee, and it kind of reminds me of like a Ray Dunn kind of little decor, you know, notebook. But yeah, for four ninety nine, and it's just a regular little notepad. That's what I thought. When I saw this, I thought it was going to be one of those like booklets that you turn the pages this way. But when I saw it this way, I thought it was so cute. This is the only one I saw in this direction. I didn't see any other, um, uh, how do you say, uh, the packaging. What am I trying to say? You know what I mean? Like the decor, the out, the outer shell, other designs. There we go. <laughs> designs. Um, I just saw this one. But yes, $4.99, I think that's so cute. Okay, next. Oh, I should have emptied out a little spot here. Oh, and let me show you guys. So this ponytail, uh, I didn't wash my hair the past like three days. And I just wanted to put this on. I know I reviewed it. I know. I know I love it. So this is the Alley Ponytail from Insert Name here. They kindly sent this over to me. And oh my gosh, you guys, on bad hair days, you just pick it up in a ponytail. This is so easy to use. It's a Velcro wrap. It has like a little comb that you put at the top of the ponytail. And then you just wrap it with Velcro and that's it. Like, And then you have a hairstyle. So this one is kind of like a beachy wave. Let me see if I can show you. A beachy wave um, already in it. So you don't straighten it you don't anything if you want straight hair they do have other ponytails on their website i will link their website down below along with a discount code but oh my gosh when they they um emailed me i was like yes i want to try it i've heard so many things about this uh good things about this company but yeah it's such an easy they even have like 20 inches uh ponytail wraps straight curly wavy i don't know curly maybe like a yeah maybe curly but they sell uh, hot tools on there, but yeah, insert name here. So anyways, I just wanted to give them a shout out because I'm loving the way my hairstyle looks despite, you know, not really styling it, you know? And then these earrings, I wanna give a shout out to Trendy Gal Shop. I will link her shop down below and you can use code Gina's Beauty Room, all caps for 15% off your order. But she has different fashion earrings uh lv coco chanel inspired she has wallets she's a small um retail shop online retail shop small business um and if things go out of stock you guys just keep trying her site um but yeah i've heard that there's been a couple of people that say whenever they go and look for products they're out of stock but keep looking she has clearance items from like uh previous holiday you know, items. She has them on clearance. But anyways, I wanted to shout those two online stores, shops out. And then you guys, I tried this. This is like off topic, but that's how I roll. Okay. <laughs> but no, this is from Laura Mercier. This, 
mascara and I'm loving the way it looks on my eyes. It's kind of like a bushy. It reminds me of the Better Than Sex mascara. And I do want to show you the wand. It's kind of different. The wand bristles turn while like the, the Better Than Sex just stay one direction. So this turns like in a spiral direction. I don't know if you can see what I'm talking about. You see that? So it just kind of makes it look really, really fluffy. And it, they kind of look almost like fake lashes. But yeah, and it's like really bushy. It kind of reminds me of those, you know what it reminds me of? Those little fuzzy worms, the little black, they, they get big too. <laughs> the worms that are black and all fuzzy, they're hairy. But anyways, but in a good way, that reminds me my lashes of that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm all over the place. So hopefully you guys are doing good today. I'm doing fine. And let's go ahead and just move on into the haul. Okay, next. A couple of clothing items I did find are, okay, they have their Valentine's. They're, oh my gosh, Home Goods, TG Maxx, Ross Marshalls. They're putting out their Valentine's Day stuff. And I saw these beautiful little cozy socks. Maybe this is like Ellen Tracy, I want to say, uh, because they had to scan a different little sock bundle for me to get this, but they do. I just wanted to show you if you're into like these cozy little booty socks, you guys, they have them out all pink Valentine's. Oh my gosh. Go pick some up. Those are like $4.99. Okay. And next look at for $12.99. I found this Def Leppard t-shirt. If you're an 80s, girl 80s boy you guys pick this up this is so cool i found this in the the men's section a size small and the, the material so so nice the brand is what's the brand uh by goodies two sleeves that's the brand right there but yes, it's so nice quality. And I, I got my husband one like last year. And so when I saw it in a small, I was like, let me get one too so we can match. And his was more like of a faded gray shirt. Okay, so next, you know, I love acrylics. Okay, so they're bringing out their acrylics again. And they, this brand specifically, Hotel Balfour, is an amazing quality acrylic brand and then the pricing of these are not bad at all considering how good quality the acrylic is it's not plastic Ac acrylic is made of different kind of resin i don't know i need to look up more to what's the difference between plastic and acrylic and anyways um and then some acrylics are even like better quality than others it's kind of like a diamond like you can get the one carat diamond ring but if it has a certain kind of quality and less rainbow in the thing <laughs> going off topic but that's kind of the same thing with acrylic acrylic quality that there's different grades of quality on acrylic $8.99 anyways my point is this brand has one of the best acrylic quality products which is again Hotel Balfour like put your makeup brushes your pins put them on your desk and it makes it look more like a high quality kind of Ah, uh, you know what I'm trying to say. Ah, uh, I get lost for words a lot. Okay, another one from the same brand for $14.99. These acrylic trays. These are in the bathroom section, and but you can use it for your uh, your sprays, your perfumes. You can even put this on here, and then put your like on your vanity. Put your brushes, your makeup brushes, and then a couple of palettes, and then a perfume or a primer. Like you can you can do so much with these little acrylic goodies here. So next, I did pick up. Man, I got I got a cool amount of stuff here. Different variety. Okay, these pimple patches, ultra blemish patch to be exact. And this is a daytime use, which is so cool because I still wear masks eight hours a day at my work and you know I get like pimples from the mask wearing yeah so these are very ultra thin so it's kind of like you don't even see it so technically I can put out like a one of these patches and then put my makeup over and it's still kind of working at minimizing the pimple anyways but yeah 399 
and there's 27 of them or no 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 there's 42 patches and there's like three different sizes so is that the brand ultra blemish patch hmm. okay zoeva is bringing more brushes out their brushes are amazing quality the bristles are very soft but like but dense on the foundation brush i love using that brush i would show you if i had it right here with me but look at that i bought another one so this is the 102 silk finish foundation brush very beautiful brush great quality look at the price 4.99 pick that up if you see it you won't regret it okay so this one i didn't own so 239 the lux soft shader brush for $3.99, look at the brush. And this is the kind, is this like that goat hair? So it packs on the product uh, more than a synthetic. You know what I mean? So it packs on the product more on your eyelid versus if you use a synthetic brush. Okay, another one. L look at this one. I thought this was so cool for contouring, cream contouring, even for $4.99. Look at this brush. This is so different. So, yeah, look at that. Like, what I want to use it for is, like, I can get my Milani cream, you know what I mean, and dip it in there and then use it to, like, chisel out my cheekbones, powder on my nose, contour. You can use this brush. It's like a multi-use, but it says it's a 109 face paint. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So it's for cream is pretty much what it's for. Yeah. I kind of like the shape. Very nice. And then one more from uh, Morphe. This is the R43. And this one was $2.99. Yeah, it's just kind of like a shader brush. You know what I mean? But what I like to use these ones for is... Let me see if I can... You see how thin it is? That's my husband. He slammed the door and then the light flickered. Hmm. Um, is for to smudge out my lower lash liner. What I like to do a lot is put my dogs, uh, my pencil liner right on the waterline and then get this immediately and it smudges out that liner. So it acts like, like a, like a shadow almost underneath the eyes, which is kind of what I did today. But of course with a different brush because this one's new. But yeah, anyways, $2.99. Look at how cute. I'm telling you, they're bringing out their Valentines. Look at these little bags. Isn't that cute? I don't even know what I'm going to use them for. I like to give my nieces gifts and stuff like that. So I'll probably use one of these for them and put little goodies in there. So for $3.99, it's a set of four. And yeah, I think these are so, so adorable. Even like to put it at for my little background when I film for y'all, right? With a little plant or something. I don't know. I'll find some good use for that. Okay, I couldn't pass it up because it was so pretty. Next, look at these. They had a whole section with these. They had like a little trio, little dish set like that you put your dips in there and then they had little plates. They, ha they had a lot of these, but I really gravitated towards this one. It's kind of like a little miniature teapot, but I'm gonna use it for makeup brushes and put it on my vanity. I think it's so, so pretty. The perfect pastel pink. Yeah, I think um, you'll love this if you love pastel pinks. Oh, it's $4.99. That's the brand. Love it. Okay, moving on. Let me just continue and take out all this lippy products. And I want to show you all the three mugs that I got. I just watched Evita Turner's YouTube or yeah, YouTube video on a haul. And she unboxed uh, stuff that she purchased at Home Goods, And she also bought like tons of mugs. I'm looking for a couple of the Ray Dunn pieces for Valentine's that she got. So yes. Thank you, Evita, for showing me all that because I'm going to go to Home Goods tomorrow and look for those products. But here is another mug. Look at that. Isn't that cute? So this is the brand. And this one was 4 dollars 
and I just think it, I love the pink inside the the way it looks it's kind of like a half heart shaped heart right there love those you can always find those little pretty mugs at home goods and then one more i did find is this one i i really liked the design of it i liked the hint of like mint green on the handle it says love it's for 4.99 and then the brand is tag but look how pretty and this is like a really thick one like, I don't know if you can see the difference of the lining of the cup. See, this one's more thick than this one. I love it. Yeah, very fun. Okay, any more? Okay, before we move on to swatches and everything, um, let me show you. So all these are going to be lippies and a couple of cheek products after these two. TJ Maxx has tons of the Creme Shop brand and Hello Kitty products out. So if you're a fan of Creme Shop and Hello Kitty, you are bound to find these at your trip to your TJ Maxx. So these are so adorable. They're lip balms. They look like little macarons. You see that? So these are for $5.99. I remember they were $4.99, but... I don't know if you've seen my last few hauls. They're raising the prices up a dollar, like everything. So anyways, $4.99 or $5.99. They were $4.99, but look how cute. I love it. Look at the detail. I am huge on trying new mascaras. You know that. I hardly use falsies um, just because they're time consuming. And I feel that my uh, every day is more like I need to be quick especially because I have an eight hour work day and then I'm commuting like two hours a day to work to and from work. But, and I don't really have time for it. I wish I had more time, but anyways, I'm always looking for new mascaras. So this one is for $4.99 and this is the pure fully charged mascara. And I'm not going to open it up yet. So, oh, this one was at Marshall's though. I've seen these at, uh, at, TJ Maxx though, so just know that. And then this one, for, I know it's a little bit more pricey for $12.99, this is the Marc Jacobs. I've been collecting all the products to this line, the cherry line, and I found this finally. So I had to pick it up. I know it's a little bit more pricey, but it's just so, this one I'm gonna show you the wand because I am gonna use it right away. So it reminds me, it's a smaller, more narrow version of the Better Than Sex mascara. So you know what, since you're here, let me show you the difference. This is the Better Than Sex from Too Faced. Okay, so you see how it's larger and this one's more, oh, don't drop it, more narrow. So let me put them side by side. There you go. Right there. Like, see, but anyways, and it's, it looks like it's going to be real black and it's going to be, it's like a wet kind of formula, which is what I like about a product. And that's why I like this one a lot. Sometimes I like drier formulas for the bottom, bottom lashes, or even like to keep the curl at the base of my lashes. And then the wetter formula mascara, I'll put at the upper half of my eyelashes. I don't know if I'm making sense, but I'm trying to situate these things, which I did. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold your horses. <laughs> okay. So we are moving on to lippies. So I spotted these, the Miss Piggy Collection and Ciate London collab. So this one is a lip balm. So this one is for $4.99. And then this one is, uh, yeah, I got two lip balms. I'm like that. If I like a product and it's pink, it's pretty, it's all the above, I will get a couple of those products. So I did get two of those. Um, separate trips. Not all this is on the same trip, you guys. I accumulate all this. I bring it to you. That way you can know past couple weeks worth what is out, what is new. So just keep that in mind. It's not all at one trip. But yes, 
that and then I got this one it's a gloss lipstick so they're all $4.99 let me go ahead and show you, you them so the lip balm is going to look like this so the packaging is gorgeous it's the perfect pastel pink look you know what I mean perfect pastel pink it's a little bit darker but oh my gosh in person it's beautiful it does look very intimidating but it's just it's sheer little tint which i find that's pretty cool that's pretty neat like you can put this kind of color on there on a lip balm and it's just a lip balm you know i found that pretty cool and it's a magnetized little look at that and the embossment of miss piggy very pretty so then this one is the gloss lipstick so same packaging. So if I open it up, let's see how this one looks. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my. Like I want to put some on now, but no. Yeah, that's gorgeous. I love the shape of the lipstick. The applicator is going to be very easy to use, you know. I hope that makes sense. <laughs> Okay, so we got White Cherry from Lime Crime. This is the Wet Cherry Ultra Shiny Lip Gloss. This one is for $6.99. I love Lime Crime. They have very, very pretty products. The packaging is on point. It's very fun, very girly. So here is the product. Very heavy quality, like, package, you know, product. So let's swatch this one. Oui. So this one is going to be sheer, of course. But it does have a little, little, tiny, tiny tint to it of this color. So really, really nude. Nothing much to it, but these are very, very nice formulas. They're not sticky at all. And then this one is, I didn't have this shade. So this is the BH Cosmetics and Miss Bella Collab. So I, I'm thinking a YouTuber. So this is $3.99. And I love the caps of this brand. It's kind of like a holographic kind of pink. See that? Beautiful. And then, yeah, I didn't even have this color. I think it's beautiful. Did I say golden peach is the shade? There you go. And I find that these ones are not sticky whatsoever either. A lot of the lip glosses nowadays are not sticky, which back then, like maybe 10 years ago, they were sticky, you know? So they've, a lot of the companies have mastered their lip gloss formulas, which is pretty cool, you know? Cause we don't want our hair to always get stuck in our, on our mouth, on our face <laughs> during like a, a windy day, you know? So, 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 if you're enjoying the video, give it a thumbs up. I'd really, really appreciate it. Yes. Okay, so next we got, look what I found for the price. $5.99, these Josie Marin or Josie Moran lip glosses. Oh my gosh, I don't own anything. Or do I? Do I own one foundation from Josie Moran? I don't know, but these were $5.99, so I had to get all the colors that were there. I don't even know how these are going to perform, if they're sticky at all. This is my first time going to be swatching them. So this one's in the shade. Yeah, I was trying to find the shades, and I couldn't find the shade on these. Okay, they're in here. So this is DYA. And I, Diani, that's this shade. Oh, oh, nice. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? It's a thick gloss. It's not thin at all. Like it goes on like with a thick application is thick. So this one is in the shade Lucy. <gasps> yes, it the it's kind of like it'll hide your fine lines because it has like that thick top coat. Okay, next one is, let's see, let's see, Cava, C-A-V-A. -A. Oh, very fun. Go to a Christmas party. 
that's so pretty look at that and then the last one is in the shade dun, 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 rosy this one's really nice too there you go so those are all your shades so these are your shades just in case you want to pick them up for yourself so you guys we're already at 30 minutes almost and there was no way i can put in all the swatches of all the palettes so make sure to stay tuned for part two this will be probably uploaded the next day so yeah just keep that in mind so i found four more of the pretty vulgar poisonous pout lip glosses plumping lip glosses so for 6.99 Look at the packaging on these two. Look at the packaging. Isn't that gorgeous? I really like their vibe. I think it's really, really cool. So this is in the shade 117. Look at the packaging to these. Aren't they gorgeous? It's just so different. This is unlike any other product. You know what? Let me wipe this off first. Their packaging is just different and I love it. <laughs> okay. Okay, so there is that one. Very nice. Look at that. It's very soft. So these are plumping. Keep that in mind. But when I wore my other one, I don't feel the tingle or anything to it. But they do look pouty. Like this also, this formula is great. It does hide those little fine lines on your lips as well. So this one is 155 beautiful little rosy pink oh look it so this one has blue flowers roses and this one has pink you see that hmm i like that wow they go on so so nice so again the top one is 117 and then the bottom one is 155 there you go so two more in that line. So I have 118 and then 59. So let's do the 118 first. This one's really sheer. Like it's not, the color is going to be very light. So you want to wear this with like a nude lipstick underneath or lip liner. And then this one is the 59. there we go and here are your two shades for that one it's just a couple more products so they put these anastasia beverly hills abh Hot holiday lip gloss set and i really really enjoy their formula as well for 14.99 it is a little pricey i collect lip gloss well i collect everything every kind of product you can imagine so I wanted to add this to my collection. So yeah. Um, do I want to add it to my collection? Do I want to save it as a gift? Let me think. <laughs> That's just a little something that me and my husband laugh about. Okay. Anyways, I don't know if I want to save these or what. I'm not going to swatch these ones. I'm sorry. But they're like really nudie shades. You see that? Okay, but I will swatch this one. So for $7.99, you can always find these MAC lipsticks in all finishes too. My favorites are the, the Powder Kiss ones. So this one's in the shade 659 Natural Born Leader. Ooh, nice brick red. Look at that. Oh, great for fall. If I really want to put like a smoky, smoky eye that'll be really pretty with it so this one i heart revolution this is such a fun fun makeup collection makeup a company you know and uh yeah i had to pick this up so the other time i hauled this one look how pretty this one is so this is the tasty peach highlighter and look how cute oh my gosh look at the embossment of the little strawberry so let's do this one and then this one 
there you go and so let's do that right here <gasps> look how nice and then i'm going to mix the two get that shade look it kind of brings it like a dual chrome if you mix the two together look at those shades those are gorgeous pick these up these are very very nice you guys yeah i recommend these a lot so pick those up so this was this one didn't have a price Th these were 3.99 but maybe they scanned a different so these are 3.99 oh you know what because it had the uh the protective plastic thing over it that's why so the last two products in this haul remember don't forget to watch part two are these from Lime Crime. I don't have these colors, so I bought them. So for $6.99, look at the packaging, how fun. So these are kind of like a creamy based formula. So I like to use these with a duo fiber brush. Look at the packaging. Oh, so this one's in the shade Pixel. Let's see. See, look, look how light it is, but I love to put these underneath powder blushes so this is a really cool tone kind of pink you see that so to put it underneath this kind of color powder blush i think it would show up really really pretty and it'll make the powder product last you know the powder blush so there is that one and then the last one is dark web let's see And it comes with a mirror. I love that. Oh, so this one's really opaque. So you're going to really have to use that dual fiber one. It's like a fall color for me. But these blend out really, really nice. I recommend these as well. Lime Crime, I love. Oh, and I did find some palettes from them. But remember, that's going to be on the next video. So stay tuned for that. You guys, that is it for this haul part one for TJ Maxx and Home Goods. I hope that you did enjoy this video. And as always, thank you so much for watching, subscribing. If you're new here, I'd love to have you join my family as I do tons of hauls and more girly content on my channel. So if, if you want to see more of me, just go ahead and press that subscribe button. And that is it. So thank you so much. I will see you on the next one. Bye guys.